when you talk about a legacy, the G word, how do you pronounce it? Legacy. Uh-uh, the G word. What? Gala. That's how you say it. Okay, so we gala. don't be on the same page for the gala. <laughs> so how do you say it? I say gala, too, but some people say gala. gala. You know, you gotta yeah. keep it. But regardless, it's gonna be a nice time in Jackson coming up soon. Can you tell me about it? Absolutely. Um, the Jackson Medical Mall Foundation, we're hosting our annual fundraiser to celebrate the generational wealth that um, created through our neighborhoods. And so building that wealth, we're gonna have a gala um, at the Jackson Medical Mall. December 6th at 7 p.m. Uh, and we're asking individuals to come out and have a good time and wear their nice fancy attire um, to celebrate the legacy not only of our founder, uh, the, the late Dr. Aaron Shirley, but others um, like our community advisory board members that have gone on. So we want to just celebrate them um, and other community leaders and stakeholders in the community. Gotcha. So when you talk about the Jackson Medical Mall, for you, what's a hidden gem inside of the building? So we are a one-stop shop um, healthcare facility. We also have array of uh, activities along with programs that are inside the building. So the hitting gym is that we are anchoring the community. Um, and um, just a couple of things that are um, off the top of my head, we have the MC uh, clinics that are there, the dental clinic. We have uh, array of restaurants inside. Uh, we have a dance studio, we have after school with robotics and artificial intelligence classes. Um, and so um, people just don't know a lot about it. They just think we're a healthcare facility mm -hmm. and we're more than that. Gotcha. So robotics even too for the kids and after school programs, that's important. But just going to the medical mall is something y'all are trying to get more people to do, right? And just see what's actually in there. Correct. And why do you think it's needed in the first place? So uh, we think that it's needed because it builds community. Um, without the community, the medical mall would not be there, first of all. Um, and so we just know that um, having those programs um, and initiatives in our organization, um, where our HIV and AIDS programs, helps link individuals to care and uh, resources. Awesome. So now you get to the Legacy Gala, and all these things obviously are going to go and support the initiatives that you already have Absolutely. going on. So tell me, what do we, you say get dressed up real nice. Are we wearing sparkles? Are we wearing red? Are we wearing white? What are we doing? We're wearing glitz, glam, um, all the sparkles, glitter. <clears throat> you name it, you buy it, you need to wear it <laughs> okay. to this event. So now I see Paul Washington on the flyer. I see myself. I see That's Rita. Right. I see who are these other folks we see? The keynote speaker. Tell me about this. So the keynote speaker is Mr. Johnny Donaldson. He is um, Bank Plus's president. Um, I don't have his title first off, but um, he's very instrumental in the community. Um, of course, yourself, uh, Kayla. <laughs> you will be our host along with Rita Brandt. Um, and so you all will be tag teaming this night. And then we have Dexter Allen, the Four Washingtons, and the 601 Live Band. It's going to be a night of some jamming, too. So that's right. So wear your good clothes, but also bring your change of shoes. That's correct. <laughs> that's right. Is Make there, sure you have those flats in your purse. All right. Now, is there anything else people need to know? They need to get tickets in advance? Yes. They could actually visit our website at thejacksonmedicalmall.org to um, purchase tickets. They can reach out to our office at 601 8467. Um, they can come in person. We can hand deliver the tickets. We can mail them um, a few weeks away. So um, grab your tickets now. Um, we don't want them to sell out. Gotcha. All right. So now well, we want them to you, sell yeah, out. But, you, but before you before can get you, that's we right. Go, we was on the same page. We was on the same page. <laughs> but now, can you give them a deadline? Because sometimes people like that. They say, okay, let me now wait till the day before. So give them a deadline. That's right. Because we will not have tickets at the door. Um, because we want to make sure um, we have everything done, um, food, uh, everything done in advance. So if you would purchase your tickets by December 1st, um, that would give us time to plan properly. Um, and so we would love to have our community stakeholders come to our event December 6th. All right, that sounds good to me. Now